Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Play Xenoblade Chronicles. Thank you for joining me. So, let's load up our last save. I made a double save for some reason, I don't know why. And like last time, I'm just going to cut past this load screen. 14 years ago. Where are we already going back in time, huh? That's interesting. Not a big fan of snow, to be quite honest. Or the heat. I like fall and spring. That's about it. And giant doors. With eyes on them. I think that was an eye. Are these Inuits, or... Is that how you pronounce it? It's the PC term for es Eskimos. Mysterious blue light. There's a shulk in the past visiting Superman. Hey, it's Dixon. No. Don't mind that noise. <laughs> oh. So the Monado wasn't something they always had, it's just something they found. And Shulk was there. Oh, my, my boy. I think that's Shulk. He's got blonde hair. And I already know there can only be one blonde male and one blonde female. And they fucking killed that one off. Going after that metal faced Mechon. But shouldn't we have some kind of plan? How about checking out Colony 6? Colony 6. The only other Homs colony left. Colony 6 is on the way to Sword Valley, where there's supposed to be a Mechon base. If that's where they came from, maybe the people in Colony 6 saw something. Good point. They might even know something about that metal face mechon. So, we go past the Magmel ruins and up through Tefra Cave. Then we should arrive at the Bionis Knee. Yeah, and if we can get to the Knee, it ain't far to Colony 6, right? Sounds like a plan. Let's head to Colony 6. Kind of want to head back in the town and see if I can finish any of those side quests. Yes, I know. We only have these two now. Gem crafting. All right, you can make other ether gems in the ether furnace in Calling Nine. Try talking to the gem man in the commercial district. I'm going to do that after I get these blue baubles. There you go. I should probably check out my uh, collection, see if I've completed anything yet. No, well, let's do that now. All right. So we finish that. We need that, that, and that. Who are you? Ooh, we got a lot of you. Attack plus two. I like it. And we get slow resist two. Interesting. HP up two. I like that. Alright, and that's it. Well, let's look at things we can equip. You can't equip anything on your armor. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're gonna get the attack plus. Freaking Ryan here. He, uh, he's pretty good on everything else. Um, we'll give you HP up because you're already a beast. You know what? We'll give you slow resist too. Or poison resist. 
since you're going to be hopefully taking the brunt of a lot of damage. There we go. Also, wouldn't mind. Well, let's go check out this heart the heart. Maybe we can actually do them now that poor Fiora. She's not here anymore. I was actually kind of really pissed off about that. Um, I know it's weird, right? How do I get in the house? Can I not go in the house anymore? That's bull. Hey, resident dude. Oh, you know what? I don't like nighttime. I heard you can switch it over. It was in the settings, I think someone said I could switch the daytime. They could have been fucking with me. Hmm. Maybe it's not that other. Change time. There you go. Well, there you go. Yes, let's go. There. The time has been changed. Uh oh Hello. You took my biscuits to that guy? Here. He's such a good boy. So sweet. Oh, um, yeah, sure. Wait, what? Sure, swimming sandals. Um... What side am I on? <laughs> Is there some sort of competition that I am unaware of? Good glide down. What about over here? You guys over here? No. Alright, well... He probably shows up at a... Are you a boy or a girl? The pendant was my mom's only one and I broke it. It even has her name engraved on it. I can't buy another one. I just hope someone... Are you a quest? You're probably a quest. Alright, gem crafter. It's like lens crafter, but with gems. I don't see you. Maybe you're not at this location. Oh. Oh, yeah. Hey, buddy. I sure I'd probably be reading this route, right? Ether particles are in the body are... Oops, that stuff too is complicated. No, just tell me. Tell me. But I haven't got the best part yet. Ready? Don't be shocked. This furnace compresses ether crystals and removes impurities. You use it to make other gems. What? No reaction? Dude, I just crapped my pants a little bit, so that's a little bit of an reaction. Hmm, <laughs> kids these days. You don't know how amazing this thing is. You can use a furnace to make ether gems, you little brat. They've got the power of ether crystals, but highly condensed. Did I accidentally talk to you again? Okay, dude, I get it. I get it. We done. Oh, thank you. Mm, tutorial. Use gems to strengthen your equipment. Gems are have various quality. If a gem is inserted into a piece of equipment that has a slot, the weapon takes on that quality. Highlight an empty slot on the changed equipment screen and press A. Select the crystal you wish to equip. As the story progress, you will gain the ability to make gems yourself. Okay. Um, can I not? Or do I have to talk to you? Hmm... Okay, yeah. I don't I'm wasn't gonna pay you. Okay. Material selection. How to create an ether gem. First select the ether crystals. There's six tutorials. Oh god. One second. Okay. First select the ether crystal to put in the furnace. Either only ether crystals of the same rank can be put in the furnace at the same time. When the, crystal, when the strength of the certain quality exceeds 100%, an ether crystal from with that quality will be formed. Put crystals with matching qualities in the furnace so that the total strength of the quality are, you are aiming for exceeds 100%. When the strength of a quality exceeds 100%, or you have already put in 8 crystals, you can add on any more crystals. 
Press A to confirm the crystals you wish to put in the furnace. After selecting the crystals you wish to use, select who will you craft. Gem crafting carries, is carried out by two party members. One is the shooter, and the other one's the engineer. Use the left and right directionals to highlight a party member, and then select A. Or press A to select them. The shooter will shoot several times during crafting and gem crafting. The results will depend on the ability of two party members. Party members have different abilities depending on whether they are acting as a shooter or as the engineer. Strong flame greatly increases the strength of one quality. Medium flame slightly increases the strength of all quality. Gentle flames fills the cylinder gauge. That's going to confuse me. <laughs> Qualities which exceed the strength of 100% during gem crafting will become ether gems. Qualities that do not exceed 100% will become cylinders. One quality for each time you have filled the cylinder gauge. Cylinders can be used again in gem crafting just like crystals. Alright, well. Muscle up. I don't know what that is. Is that the only one I have? Oh, muscle. Oh, there you go. I, I guess confirm. Strong bonus. Okay, whoa. Okay. Confirm. I'm all over I've that. got it. Alrighty. To me. Alrighty. To me. Awesome. Alrighty. There we go. Alright. To you, there we go. All right, to you, to me. Woo. <laughs> to you, there we go. Awesome, thanks a lot. <laughs> uh, strength up, <laughs> take all, take craft a gem, increases physical. Oh, Jesus, that sucks. Yes. Do we have any more? Oh, we have one of those, and we have none of those. Hmm. So we do strength up. We do strength up. Yeah. Then we're gonna speed this up because I don't want to listen to them talk to each other again. I'm all over that. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Uh, sure. What else can we make? Let's get agility up. We get ether up. First attack plus. You know what? No. <laughs> Initial tension. Don't we have another one of those? No. Ether up. Well, we can make those. How about this? Ether. Agility. 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 No, I want. Agility. God damn it. Alright, we gotta put them in an order, huh? We'll do that. 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 And we'll do. We can't do two, huh? Thanks. Yeah, we can't do both of them. Ah, well, we'll fuck around with it later. Yep, great. Yeah, I learned crafting. Let's uh, adjust the time, see if we can get this guy to show up. Yeah, sure. You there, buddy? Are you there? You're not there. Well, let's try again. And I think we'll move on with the story as much as we can. Will he not spawn while I'm here? I mean, the other guys did. Hey, quest. You know what? <laughs> You know what, game? I'll deal with you later. Now let's try this. Yes. Alright. 
let's uh, make it daytime and then get the hell out of here. No, wait, wait. I thought we were already at midnight. Oh, okay. Anyone? Ain't no, yeah, okay. Sure, we'll do 5 a.m. All right, yeah, screw you guys. You can deal with your own side quest later. Such a silly jump. Oh, if you're watching this and you're wondering where my Final Fantasy IV LP is, uh, it's coming. It, it, it really is. For some reason, the last few times I've recorded, it does the, the goddamn crashing thing again. And I'm kind of sick of it because it happened like a few times. Uh, hold on, blah, blah, blah. Through to get... Okay, so we gotta go back to the cave. Yeah, the, the game crashes on me now after every other battle. <clears throat> and I'm not really happy about that. And obviously, for obvious reasons. So I have to travel through here. Let's try this over here first. Heart to heart. Oh, yes. Every time you come here, it brings back memories. Same for you, right? Yep. We've been through a lot together, you and me. Oh, yeah. You remember that time? You know, you know that one time. When we had that big fight? When Dunban told us off? That's the one. Ah, yeah. Okay, it's usually the biggest bust-up we've ever had. In all the years I've known you, nothing else has come close. It was bad, all right. I'm just glad we made it up afterwards. You know, for such a big argument, I don't even remember what it was about. You, we were really young. It was probably just some silly kid thing. You're probably right. Hey, Shulk, do you ever think about it? Without me bringing it up, I mean... Nope. Fuck. Okay, so apparently I pissed Ryan off. Well, you know what, Ryan? We're having an argument now. I hate you, silly. Yeah, you definitely are s different. I'm stupid, so I just forget stuff if I don't keep thinking about it. You say the funniest things. I bet it, I'm just as bad, though. You're both kind of spaceheads sometimes. The point is, we got everything off our chest back then. And now we hardly ever argue. Pretty great, huh? And even if we do have another fight, I know we'll survive it. Because I have the Monado and you have nothing. Oh wait, Monados can't hurt humans. Right. We'll be friends forever. At least, that's what I'm hoping. Aw, me too, man. Me too. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Yeah. Alright, so, we have to go through here? Ooh, that closed door. That's the closed door, right? Maybe? Potentially. Let's teleport there. Ah, slight music change. And loading times! Uh, that's the rear entrance, and... Can we change the level? Okay, well, we'll just teleport here. There's a quest up there. That's interesting. Oh, there's the next waypoint, or not waypoint, but story point. Oh, hello. Oh, you're just in time. I think my partner went to check out the cylinder hangar. I'm worried, he's not back yet. That doesn't sound good. Ah, uh, didn't you see strange... Oh, you want me to go there? Can you take a look for me? I'm really worried, although if things turn out actually we can always jump into the lake. But that's pretty, also pretty scary. Ryan, how about it? Well, yeah, 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 sure. Sure, why not? Hey, we get some equipment. I'm happy with that. No problem. 
Nothing is. Oh, we got a affinity thing up for that. Okay, and experience. You have another quest. I got something else I like you. Want to hear me out? Yeah, sure. How many collect uh, Atrino silk? I think that's how you pronounce it. That stuff can sell for a pretty good price. Then why wouldn't I sell it? Wait, does he have six kids? Jeez, dude. I I guess I'll help you out. You should probably wrap your shit, though, before, you know, fucking your wife. Uh, I'm gonna assume it's your wife. Could be just some random lady you met on the street. Okay. Cutscene! This door, it was closed when we came past before. But it's open now. Maybe it was programmed to open up in case of mech on emergency. The way to the bionis knee is just ahead. You ready? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go. After these side quests. Where do I need to get those silks from? I don't remember fighting any spiders. Mm. Oh, blue bobble. Yeah, you lizard guys can F off. Oh, I could have just teleported up here. Ah, well, whatever. Gives me the chance to collect some more bobbles. There's one now. Thank you, live rat that I'm now holding hostage. Shulk, you have a problem, man. Okay. Ooh, another heart to heart. Well, since I have a tendency to fuck well, at least one part of them up. Uh -oh. Hey, buddy. Why is he worried about me? Does he love me? I think he does. He's always worrying about something or the other. You can see I'm fine. Ain't nothing wrong here. There's no point in reporting back. I can just carry on my own war- uh, he'll just carry on worrying. So he gives us the reward. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. And then we'll do the heart to heart. Maybe. Fuck you. Uh, let's see how that equipment is. I probably missed some hearts for hearts- uh, heart to hearts with, uh... Fiora. So I lose six points of defense, but I gain agility and ether defense. No. What about leather bottoms? Because we only have middle leggings. Yeah, that's a lot better. We can do swim trunks. Oh, we did get uh, flippers, didn't we? That's just silly. Alright, well, oh, you know what? I have those crystals I can equip now. Here. You can have an agility. Oh, you can have strength up. And, you know, I'm pretty, pretty alright with what we have right now. He has a quest. <laughs> Why? <laughs> So I'm, I'm probably not going to do all the quests in the game. I'm supposed to make sure I kept it safe. That's it. I must have dropped in Tep Raya Cave. I looked everywhere but can't find it. Was it really that important? My girlfriend gave it to me for our luck when I joined the force. Ah, you really love that thing. All night long. Oh man, you... I know I can teleport around. Quick quark gear? Quark gear. Quark gear. God damn it, Ryan. Stop liking me more for doing these stupid quests. Can I do this now? No. That's the lake down there, right? Oh, there we go. Alright, so I hear you can jump from this. Actually, some people are like, why didn't you just jump from this before? I'm a scaredy cat. Okay, no offense, but 
He should be screaming like a little bitch right now. <laughs> Seriously, I would. I'd be fucking... Oh. <laughs> the whole time, ah, oh, god damn it, why did I listen to the fucking YouTube comments? These new enemies? Hello? Hello? Well, fine, I don't want to fight you either, you assholes. What about you guys? Guys, guys. Everyone, let's go! I hate these things. You hate them, Ryan, that's mean. You're a lifesaver. Yeah, Ryan, you I'm feeling it. I guess you helped out there. I think I did more damage than you. We can definitely do this. Oh, defeat the monster. So I guess we were supposed to do that. Filthy wing. More bubbles. Everyone, let's go. Let me no, you can only use that against uh Necon. Alright. You guys have a lot of hit points. Yeah, it's Ron time. And this was more quests. Alright, and was that a silver chest? It had stars. Nah, it's just a crappy regular chest. Muddy pelts. Right, I wonder where that pendant is. This is the right lake, right? Well, it doesn't matter. There's a bunch of bobbles over here. Bobble. Bobble. White beetle. I hope I can figure out the whole crashing issues with Final Fantasy IV, because I want to finish that LP. I know it has nothing to do with Xenoblades, but it kind of sucks, because I'm like almost, I'm like halfway through the game. Not, I'm more than halfway through the game, but it's just bad. It adds so much time to the recording when, I keep, when it keeps crashing and I have to keep restarting the game. Um, yeah, I'll get back to that, though. I've looked on the internet and people are having problems. Did I leave a chest back here? What's that shiny thing? Shiny thing. I did leave a chest over here. How did I leave a chest over here? Eh, it's just a filthy wing, but... So he said he dropped it near the lake. You guys are no match for me, nor do I want to fight you. Probably should just to gain experience, but... I wonder if that unique encounter respawned yet, or if it does. Plate snow. I think we already have one of those. We had a quest for Crabble, didn't we? We, well, I fucked that guy up hardcore. Uh, okay. Did I finish like a uh, quest or something? I got a lot of experience for that. Dance Apple. I don't think I've seen that one before. And then I get two of them. Alright, well, we're getting close to the episode, and I can't find this guy's next Nicholas. But I'm gonna go over here and get these baubles. And then we're gonna teleport back up to the cave entrance and, uh,. End the episode, I think. No, here. Alright, well, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you haven't subscribed yet, why don't you go over to my video section and uh, check out some of my past content and see if it's to your liking. Either way, have a great day, and I will see you all next time. Bye.